screw the fluff we're going to dive right into this one so there's going to be less than 10 things you're going to need to do in order to make this happen in 30 days or less i'm going to explain each one and the pitfalls to avoid so number one you're going to begin by drinking more water this helps boost your metabolism which helps burn fat more efficiently and it wards off those unnecessary cravings and as a caveat it helps promote healthier skin making you look younger number two you're going to have to eat more nutrient dense foods and here are the benefits eating this way provides you with more energy throughout the day just like water helps your metabolism burn fat more efficiently. It prevents disease and obesity and provides you with all the essential vitamins and minerals you need. Moving on to number three, getting quality sleep. You're gonna want to go to sleep no later than 9 or 10 p.m. every evening. Make sure your room is completely dark. Remove all electronics, including TVs, cell phones, and digital alarm clocks, especially those with blue lighting. Your room should be in cold room temperature. Your last meal of the day should be at least six to seven hours before bed. Also, don't drink any liquids two hours before bed and no screen time at least an hour to an hour and a half before going to bed. It's absolutely paramount that you understand how much sleep plays into all of this. Here are ways in which to wind down and relax prior to going to bed. You may wanna consider consuming some blueberries or dark chocolate. If you choose dark chocolate, make sure it's 80 to 100% and also make sure it has no more than four or five grams of sugar. The antioxidants and flavonoids found in blueberries and especially in dark chocolate is known to relax you and also promotes calmness. Magnesium is also something you could consider taking as it helps uh, for sleep. Number four, this is obviously a no brainer. Number four is going to be engaging in regular exercise. You're going to want to get on a workout routine where you're lifting weights three to five times a week. Believe it or not, engaging in strength training burns more calories than cardio. And it's the only proven method to get you in the best shape the fastest. Something else I recommend is walking anywhere from 10,000 to 20,000 steps a day for optimal health. Something to keep in mind, sore muscles equals growth hormone spikes, which burns fat. Number five, avoid toxic people who stress you out. Stress produces the release of cortisol in which cortisol leads to weight gain. And it also turns protein, good fats and ketones into sugar. Moving on to number six, intermittent fasting. This one I absolutely cannot stress enough. Engaging in fasting, any form of fasting, allows your digestive system a break and it helps keep it from getting overly taxed. Intermittent fasting is going to provide you with an enormous surge of energy throughout the day, mental clarity, and less cravings throughout the day. Number seven, avoid these three, simple carbs, alcohol, and too much sugar. All of these spike your insulin levels. High insulin levels stops fat burning. Number eight, don't be perfect. This one, I often find myself having discussions with uh, a lot of my clients about. It's not about being perfect, guys. Eat healthy at least 80% of the time. It's about excellence, not perfection. Number nine, this is where it gets really good. Have a strong why. Here are things that you need to start thinking about. Do you wanna play with your kids 
without constantly getting tired? Do you want to be able to keep up with them? Do you want to live to see your kids get married? Do you want to share stories with your grandchildren? Or do you prefer to subtract meaningful years from your life expectancy by withering away and dying prematurely like most Americans do? If you found value in this video, make sure to click on this one and I will see you on the next one.